a little piece of um, 30. I'm going to put it not too far. I don't want her to, I don't want it to be too hard for her to get it. It was maybe a bigger piece of sardine than she really needs. Good girl. Okay, get out of there. Get out of there. So I'm going to tell her when to get out. I'm going to throw something back in there further, a little bit further, and then, oops, 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 wait, wait, wait. Right. And close the door. And wait till she, she'll, she shows me that she really wants to go in there. Oh, okay. I guess so. I'll let you get it. Trust. Right. Got you. <laughs> you get it. Good girl. Nice. Good job. Okay, all done. I'm gonna let her lick my fingers because they're slimy. That's why. Close the door again. And so, I'm not going to pressure her in any way at all. We're going to let her decide. I really, really want to get in there and get that thing. You interested? In it? Oh, oh, all right. I guess I'll let you go get it. No, it's okay to do that kind of thing when she barks like that. Yeah, I mean, the barking is a separate thing. She's showing some anxiety and she's showing some a variety of things. So. We're not going to, we got to just focus on one thing at a time. Um, and the, the, bark, the barking is going to go as she becomes more clear about what it is that she's supposed to do or not. But definitely when she barks in other situations, you do not want to reinforce her for barking, right? Right now, it's like she's trying, she's trying to make that fish come her way. All right, all done. Okay, all done, all done. So at home, you know, when you do it, when you do it at first, I think probably, so that's obviously too hard for her. She can't put one paw in this big, huge crate. So at first, what you're going to do is you're just going to maybe put it really close, make it really easy. I'm going to make it easier for her. She may have been barking because she wanted me to fix it for her. So I didn't want to fix it when she was barking at me, right? I'm not going to, she's not going to bark and then I'm going to go and give her a treat. Right but there. That's what we want. So we want to see her nuzzling the door a little bit and deciding, you know, I'm kind of interested. I want to get in there. You, you want to get in there? And then you can kind of go, okay. All right, honey, you want to see that? You can get in. Let's see, you just have to, you get it. It's just, yeah. All right, you can get it. And then, good girl. And then tell her, okay, get out of there. Okay, get out of there. And then you close the door. And then when you, when you do the get out of there, you, then you can put like another one in there, right? So when she leaves, it's like, you know, I told you to get out. Oops. You're all done. Get out of there. I'm just going to put it a little bit closer. There you go. A little bit more back. So you just kind of repeat it, right? She's going to look and go, I'm interested. And if she doesn't want to get it right now, if she goes, that was exhausting. That's all I can do. That's fine. It's like, you can leave it and come back later when you see that she's showing some interest and go, yeah. and you can just give her permission to get it. Okay. No pressure to go into the crate, but just permission. You can have it, you know, I'm gonna let you. Okay. I'm gonna let you. And if she's going, I'm not sure I want it that bad and I don't wanna go get it, then it's like you need to get a different treat, a bigger, you know, a different situation. Um, you, you're not gonna pressure her in any way to get it, okay. no pressure. If she's not interested in getting it, she does not have to get it. But if she's curious about it and she wants to get it, you can give her permission to get it. Yeah, you want that, sweetie? Okay. Yeah, go get okay. that. Good girl. Good girl. And then tell her, all right, all done, get out of there. Okay, all done. Out all done, come. get out of there. And then I'll, I'll, since my hands are all slimy, I will replenish. Oh, that's right, I forgot. My hands are the slimy ones, so I'll just stick with it. I'm going to put it back just a little bit further. Okay. Wait for her to decide she's curious. And so she's she's not that 
interested in it right now, right? She's like, I'm not sure. She doesn't really trust it. And so that's okay. So you, you know, might have to grow that mm -hmm. interest right. in it slowly. And you're going to wait for her to decide, I want to go in there. And if she doesn't, we're not going to shove her or push her or pressure her or any other thing. We want to make this like a special place that I'll give you permission to go get it. Taking the time, a lot of times just taking the time to let her decide I'm, I'm interested is really worth it.